Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for Training Thursday. I'm Jordan Bateman, the Director of Communications for the Independent Contractors and Businesses Association, the mighty ICPA, joined <laughs> as always by... Carrie Vital, Project Coordinator for the Training Department here at ICPA. All right. We don't actually call it ICPA, do we? No, well, some people do. Some people do. It's some people a, think we're ICBC. It's, it's troubling sometimes. I can uh, fully confirm we are not ICBC. All right. <laughs> Um, thank you for watching, and uh, we are live again here, which is exciting because uh, we were offline for a few days there, but uh, everything oh. is coming back together. And yep. we are going to talk about blueprint reading courses. And I got to say, Carrie, um, we have a course coming up in Burnaby July 27th on this, yep. but you guys are really planning ahead uh, December, <laughs> December 17th in Burnaby. That is our civil blueprint reading course, and yes, we are planning very far in advance. We actually have courses booked uh, into 2019 now, okay. so we are very well prepared. We like to make sure people can plan their training calendars really far in advance. So yeah. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, introduction to blueprint reading. I mean, yeah. this is one of our, our more popular courses. Mm -hmm. We offer it quite a bit because so many people have benefited from it and want to take it. Exactly. It's almost like... Uh, open Shop does their own training and doesn't need fancy uh, overpriced building trades unions to tell us how to do simple things like, uh, you know, train workers. What a very novel oh, sorry. concept. Jordan. Sorry, I'm a little bitter this Anyway. <laughs> Anyways, introduction to Blueprint Reading Course in Burnaby, yeah. July 27th. Uh, learning how to read sets of residential and commercial blueprints. Yep. Um, so come one, come all. Uh, look, super helpful. I mean, obviously, <laughs> nothing gets built without the plan. Um, you know, this is like the, the core foundational skill that, uh, that will help folks uh, out on the construction site. Um, and it comes with some credits. We, we know you do love your credits. So you'll okay. earn one gold seal credit for oh the intro to Blueprint. gold seal credit. I don't know. Uh, and seven Group A CPD points from BC Housing for the uh, intro course. And Perfect. then for the Civil Blueprint reading course that we have in December, you'll also earn one gold seal credit for that one. Right. So uh, July 27th in Burnaby, uh, that's the introduction to uh, Blueprint reading. December 17th in Burnaby, uh, Civil Blueprint reading course, icba.ca slash training. But Carrie, you know, seeing that date December 17th makes me think, about Christmas. Oh good, and my favorite wait, topic. You know, and, and the big plans I'm sure you already have in place for you and, and Deb and the family. Hugely, yeah, I'm really planning in advance for that. Carrie is a, pretends to be, I'm gonna say pretends because it's not true, but she pretends to be a bit of a Christmas curmudgeon. Like uh, she's a little bit scroogey. Last year she uh, pretended she didn't care about all I the, uh, the antics I, I did on. not. And then a Christmas miracle happened. Hmm, really, did it? A, poster arrived from the Cincinnati Zoo featuring um, Carrie's all-time favorite internet personality, Fiona the Hippo. I really, really love hippos. I am not quite sure how somebody figured that out. Maybe somebody follows me on Instagram and Twitter, but that's not the point. We dig deep here. So. <laughs> and all of a sudden, it was like a Christmas miracle happened, and Carrie's little Grinchy heart grew three sizes that day. And you were very, very pleased with yourself. I was very pleased. So who knows what's so, going to show up this year. So but, Christmas uh, miracles yeah. happen. <laughs> it all happens. That's a gold seal credit if you're taking the Civil Blueprint reading in December 17th. It's a gold seal credit in your heart if you can make Carrie love Christmas. Oh, boy. All right. Have a Merry <laughs> Christmas, everyone, here in, uh, what is it, July 19th. That's horrifying. What a world we live in. We, we now work, actually. We're now attached to a mall. We're going to have some really easy time Christmas shopping. Yeah. I'm not sure about the parking situation, though. Yes. At least we have get parking spaces. But yeah, if you do not come to work on time, yeah. you will not get a space. Yeah, we've, been, we've been warned about this. Uh, <laughs> the, the interesting thing, though, for us is that, like, I don't know about everyone else, but for me, every year I seem to buy more and more online for Christmas. Yes. This might be the year that reverses that curse because, like, I'm attached to Metro Town Mall. Well, it's going to be easy. It's I mean, like, I'm oh, not hey. attached. But, uh, well, the building we work in is attached above Metro Town Mall. No, it'll be good. Kind of, oh, hey, it's 11 o'clock. I've got 20 minutes. So I'm just going to run down and grab a gift. Mm -hmm. Take a little bit of a break. So, yeah, it go to the might Disney be store. That sounds pretty awesome. Buy yeah. superhero stuff. It's great. For yourself, I'm assuming. Obviously. Yeah. No, for Jack. <laughs> I'll buy it for my kid. Oh, then, okay. Yeah, and then he'll let me play with it. All right. <laughs> That's it for another Training Thursday. We'll see you next week on Wednesday, Training Wednesday, because certain people have Thursday and Friday off. Well, there's a reason. My brother is getting married. We're all excited about this. So, come on. There's reasons. I'm not yep. just taking random days off. Deb, is he going to walk Deb down the aisle? Um, and she's going to, like, pinch his cheek? I'm not sure about the pinching of a cheek thing, but yes, my brother is walking down the aisle with uh, my parents and his dog, actually. It's I'm not doing cute. this wedding, am I? I don't think I am. 
No. I think that would have. I think that would. I I would have reminded you by now. I think that would have come across at some point in an email. It's true. You would. Okay. Good. All right. I am doing two (laughs) weddings next weekend, so you never know. Where am I? Exciting. I don't know. Anyways, uh, (laughs) if you're getting married and you're watching this uh, and and uh, doing your wedding, don't worry, I'll be there. I promise. Okay. Once again, icba.ca/training, and thank you if you put up with this malarkey for as long as you have. (laughs)